Welcome to our sixth episode of the Canadian Landscape Series. Today, we're going far north to visit a sinkhole on the forest floor. Sometimes, it seems like northern Canada is a completely different planet. It is home to a number of spectacular, subarctic, unique, and beautiful landscapes. One of them is Bear Rock Sinkhole, hidden in the boreal forest. This aquamarine waterhole is an unexpected wonder, a true marvel and a beautiful secret spot. Can you just click on the subscribe button? I promise you it won't cost you a penny. I guess I should have said a nickel since pennies are not there anymore. Between the town of Tulita and Norman Wells, in the great roadless vast lands of the Northwest Territories, you will find this odd, strange, but stunning opening, almost a perfect oval in the ground. It's not small, about 120 meters long and 60 meters wide, bigger than a football field, with 40 meters deep into the waterline. How did it come to be? The simple answer is collapse of a last subterranean cave. In geological terms, this is a type of karast landform, an ellipse-shaped sinkhole with an underground lake. But let me explain. Most parts of Northwest Territory's bedrock is composed of limestone and dolomite. Both of these are soft rocks, and they slowly dissolve in acidic water. When it rains, it mixes with carbon dioxide as it comes down through the atmosphere. Once it hits the ground, it collects more carbon dioxide in the soil, turning into carbonic acid solution. This solution seeps into the limestone bedrock via cracks. Over the course of thousands of years, this erosive process creates an underground drainage system and caves. Water fills these openings like underground lakes as they erode the area even more. Eventually, it erode most of the bedrock and ground becomes weaker and collapses. There are a few sinkholes in the region between Tulita and Norman Wells, but none compared to Bear Rock in size, depth, or beauty. This is one of the stunning examples of fresh karst landforms on the planet. Department of Environment and Natural Resources of Government of Northwest Territories completed the survey in 2008 and is recommended that this area will be preserved. If you ever fly from Yellowknife to Norman Wells, keep an eye out. You can see this beauty from your plane. You can reach there by skidoo in the winter, but Bear Rock Sinkhole is at its best in late spring and summer. It is little harder to get there in the summer, but if you are an adventure and you have access to a good off-road vehicle, you could go there, or you can fly there in a chopper. One word of caution, don't jump in. You'll never get out. The walls are vertical and steep. Would you like to visit Bear Rock Sinkhole and see this? I can't wait to go see this place. It's so cool, isn't it? Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. See you all next time with another uniquely Canadian landscape.